Hey everyone, James Reeves with TFB TV here at TriggerCon 2022. And a little departure, TriggerCon moved from Bellevue, Washington, where it's been for years, now post-COVID, here at the Flint Oak Lodge in Kansas, middle of nowhere. It's like three hours from Kansas City, two hours from Wichita, but it's beautiful here. We're in the lodge, tons of people from the industry, tons of media people. We're having a great time. There's a bunch of new products, of course, that they've unveiled here at TriggerCon. We're going to show you some of them now, but make sure you subscribe to TFB TV Showtime and enjoy the show. Hey guys, it's Andrea with Stern Defense. I got something new to show you today. So we've got our Rabad. It's a rapid attach buttstock adapter. This connects super fast. So it connects to any uh, standard lower receiver via a flange connector and to your buffer tube via a castle nut. You also have a buffer spacer in here so you can use your same buffer system. You don't have to use a plug for your bolt or anything like that. So um, it's really great. It makes your things more compact, easy to pack up, easy to conceal. It's uh, $139.99. It comes out in about four weeks. Hey guys, I'm Nick here with Palm Rady. So today we have our new PF320. Uh, this is one of our newest products that Paul and Rady has released. So this is based on the SIG 320 that we all are aware of. You know, everyone carries one of those. Um, so it's on the carry version, so on a compact slide. Um, so still we have the 1911 grip angle, uh, double undercut trigger guard, full rail, front and rear slide serrations. Uh, so the MSRP on this, guys, is 849. Um, and we are shipping these today. Hey everybody, I'm Ron from Trailblazer Firearms, here talking about our new threaded barrel life card and 22 long rifle. It comes standard with a half by 28 thread, ready to accept any of your standard 22 long rifle suppressors. And, uh, It'll fold up and fit inside of the smallest pocket that you have. These start at around $300 retail. You can uh, get them through your dealer, available through all the major distributors that are out there in the country. And uh, we're starting to ship them right now in October. What's going on everybody? I'm Brandon from, from Franklin Armory and we're out here at TriggerCon in lovely Kansas. We're actually showcasing our brand new F-17L. It's got our billet, lever toss billet, upper and lower. And we have actually redesigned this thing through and through. So we have our brand new handguard just coming out. Hopefully we can put that across our, all of our rifles, it would be nice. But the true magic is the redesign of the Osprey piston. We actually went with a uh, low profile design this time. And this is actually predicated off the world's first gas piston rim fire system. Shoots a 17 Winchester Super Mag. So that's a lot of velocity coming out of a little tiny round, about 20 grains and probably 3,200 feet per second. And uh, we even actually redesigned the mags as well. So now they're not aluminum anymore, they're polymer. We have a little indexing pin so you could load it easily. And this thing is a varmint hunter's dream. We don't have an actual MSRP on it yet and it's actually in production. So we should be seeing this pretty soon, almost finally, uh, finalizing that price. My guess, if I was a betting man, I'd say sub 2,000, probably 1,800 bucks. That could change though, so fair warning. Hi, Dave Larson with Max and Defense here at uh, TriggerCon 2022. Today, actually, we have two ranges. We have a suppressed range, but up here in the rifle range, we have our MD-11, an SR-25 platform, it has a, a two-stage Geisley trigger, proof research barrel, comes in a 308 or 65 uh, Creedmoor. Uh, it's actually available now, and they're $42.95 depending on the barrel. There's a stainless steel barrel as well as the, the carbon fiber. So we also um, launched the NRA this year, our MD9, so it's our 9 mil PCC platform. Most of, us, uh, most of you know us from the PDX uh, being short, so what we've done is moved it into a 9 mil. We've got a modified hate brake at the front to take all of the gases and percussions and push them downrange away from the shooter. It has our uh, CQB stock or brace, comes in a, a brace version as well. We have the SBR here today. And as you notice, we've elongated the magwell to give another um, handling point. It has a Geisley ALG trigger as well as the radiant charging handle. 
and uh, uses Glock mags and has a, a hold open feature. Um, comes in arid, black, or this is our urban gray. So it's, a, it's available in shipping today. Uh, the price point on it is $19.95. Hey, I'm Grant with AB Suppressor uh, to give you guys a look at what we have to offer today. Uh, this is our flagship lineup, the, the Raptor. We did 25 years in turbo machinery before we ever made a suppressor. And our chief engineer used that knowledge in fluid dynamics to design our baffle system. We call it Spiral Tech. Uh, what we try to do is kick the gas into a spin rather than having a dead end baffle that causes gas to crash into it and rebound, sending it back down your bore or uh, across the bore and interfering with the flight of the bullet. The other thing that we do that's pretty unique is we offer reflexes. So the, the muzzle is actually out to here on these cans. And the reflexes are giving us more volume without adding to the overall length. Gives the gas somewhere else to go besides back down the bore, uh, which is super important, especially on something like direct impingement. Uh, but also it's gonna lower the tone a lot. Think about like using a beer bottle to whistle, like blowing over the top of it. The more volume you have, the lower the tone is. And attenuation is really important for us. Uh, a couple other things we offer is the Little Bird. This is a really unique can that we have because 22 cans suck to clean and, and, and you know it. So what we did is, let me grab another one here, is we threaded the entire inside of the suppressor. So we're adding a little bit of air turbulence, which means better suppression performance, but we're also able to thread the baffles like a tap. Every little bird comes with this tool that'll allow you to go, go down inside the suppressor and grab the baffles and spin them out. And since they're threaded like a tap, it's gonna clean it just taking them out. Then once you get them out, you can use the pins on the tool that you use to grab the baffle and just scrape the baffle face clean. Then you're done. It also allows you to tune the suppressor a little differently. So like, especially like 22 PRS guys, any little tweak they can make to get some extra performance, they kind of go nuts for that.